Man, you know, we defense, we're going to play hard, man, get, get as many turnovers as we need to, and, and, and offense stay fundamentally sound, and we'll be all right, man. Special teams flying around, too. Offense, defense, special teams, man, so it's going to win for us. Black on football, baby. <laughs> Black on football, baby. Black on football, we the real number one, baby. Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Jackie Robinson Stadium. Well, this was this is an unexpected matchup in the preseason. A champion versus a champion. What a great way to start off week two as we get 2015 rolling. And uh, with me is, uh, wait, wait, you were coach before of this team at one time. Uh, I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> he, he's back. That's Tony Reed. Leon Williams coached the team to a remarkable 17-1 record last year. Uh, he has uh, moved on. Tony Reed comes back uh, down from uh, his owner's perch to coach again. And, uh, boy, this is a great move to get the Barnstormers here who could have sat on their laurels and said, hey, we're done with our season. We're good. Uh, we just finished undefeated, but they wanted this challenge. So tell us how that uh, th that came to be. Well, as you know, we were supposed to play the North Bay Rattlers, the champions um, from Northern California. And about two weeks ago, they pulled out on us. You know, no reason, just we're not going to come. So it kind of sucked to, you know, not play against, you know, one of Northern California's best teams. But um, we, we, um, we talked to the next best um, team out there, which is the Central Coast Barnstormers, and um, Joffrey um, did a great job of um, having dialogue with me, and we talked about things and got things put together, and here we are today with um, two top-tier teams in California battling it out. Back here before our second preseason game gets going on on uh, Blackhawk TV, uh, with us now is uh, Andre Velasquez, and... Uh, you know, a lot of big changes happened uh, with the Blackhawks in the offseason. Uh, a lot of big acquisitions, too. Uh, big news happening in in, um, in the past two weeks, picking up the Barnstormers instead of the Rattlers. Uh, th th this is great. Talk about the uh, offseason acquisitions and uh, your, your role uh, as it'll play out. Um, I mean, Tone went out there. He only get the best. So, you know, people come to him. Uh, you know, they want to play for the best. But, you know, Tone always makes sure the talent that we bring in or a good acquisition that's going to fit our program and our team so we can keep uh, the, uh, building the tradition and, you know, the team we got here. Uh, I mean, as far as me, he put in so many players where we all going to fit the, the piece of the puzzle, you know, to go ahead and get this back to back to back to back, <laughs> yes. you know. <laughs> so, I mean, with that being said, man, we ready to go out here and show the North what the South is about. So it's first and ten, and on first down, good protection. The ball is loose on the first play. Roy Otis, welcome back. Touchdown, Englewood. Are you serious? Day, 73 degrees. Otis and Johnson are there on the sack. Blackhawks will let it slide this time. Parrish throws. He gets his man. It's a first down, and it's Deshaun Edmond. On, on first down, Parrish will run himself. to them. Someone lost his helmet. It's Parrish to the 40. 45. He gets more room and into Barnstormer territory. And 19, he throws, picked off. It's Mike Johnson. This time Malden again. He turns around. He should have crossed. He did. Touchdown, Inglewood. Would have been a 32-yard field goal attempt. The pass. He gets it. 
Play action. Parrish throws. He'll go for it all. Looking for Hutchinson. He got it for the Blackhawks. Here it is in week two. Edmund with the catch. He dives. Stops at the one. The dive wasn't good enough. Parham on a sweep. Touchdown. Parrish over the middle. He does. Edmund. What a way to wrap it up for the two-point conversion. Hey, 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 how we come out? Dictate how that scoreboard gonna look. Yes, sir. Is he gonna blow this shit off the water? Or is he just gonna bail yeah. this should be a tight ass game? Fanny on three, fanny on me! One, two, three! Yeah. 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 Do you wanna get out? Oh, what you gonna do, baby? Do you wanna get out? Tell me. Oh, what you gonna do? Do you wanna get out? Oh, what you gonna do? Do you wanna get out? Beat this trick. I'd rather give you my beer. I'd rather give you my BH. I'd rather give you my BH. Five, it is first down and 20. Murphy hands off to Eli. Dupree gets forced back by Johnson. Murphy thrown back and a fumble. Parrish with time, Edmund, 40, 35. We start our final quarter with a completion. Are you kidding me? He usually plays defense, that's Corey Johnson. Back to pass is Parrish on second and 11. Wide open is Hutchinson at the 44. First down. Good blocking instead, Parrish throws. He gets Corey Johnson at the 40 yard line. Fourth and 15, they jump the gun, it's blocked. But they could make something out of this. Sterling Montgomery will run it and drop at the 15 yard line to hold. There it is, there's the snap. It's end over end, it's wide left. Eight seconds left. Murphy to throw. Thought I saw a flag. There wasn't. Roy Otis with the big sack at the 15-yard line. 